Yeah. And everybody's different too. Like my, my webinar is like over two hours long oh. and some people will say, Jacques, that was the greatest thing ever. Like I learned so much. Thanks for teaching so much. Like you completely changed the way I think about piano. And then other people will be like, dude, you think way too much of yourself. You talk too much. Like <laughs> I'm unsubscribing right now, you know, and both people watched the exact same video yeah. and, and came away on completely opposite sides of the spectrum. So you can't appeal to everybody. So that's really interesting that you said yours is about two hours. We've got a, a guy we worked with, um, James Svetic, really good friend of mine as well. And he runs a course on Airbnb, like how to make money from renting out other people's property on Airbnb. And he changed his uh, product to be available only through, um, without sales call. It used to do with sales calls. It reduced mm -hmm. the price a bit and made it available directly as a sale. And he increased the length of his webinar to like, two and a half hours mm -hmm. so he could build up like way more trust and you're saying yours is about two hours and it's like i know that there's a big drop off from webinars about a point of an hour but the people who sit it's not really how many people watch it's how many people buy so that's super interesting did you always have it as two hours long or did you experiment with that or how yeah pretty much i mean the i definitely had my fair share of failures with uh with webinars like live webinars um i never did my first evergreen until I made a significant amount of sales on like a live webinar. Right. My first few live webinars were total flops and I those were probably less than an hour if I had to guess. But once I once I ramped it up, like had my webinar more dialed in, they were approaching more like the two hour mark is when they started being successful. Now, just making it longer is not the key. Like it's the <laughs> content <laughs> Talk within really there. slowly, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's not about that. It's the, con you know, but like with my Evergreen webinar, I'm pretty sure that the offer doesn't come in until the one hour and nine minute mark, right? Yeah. So you've got to, to even see the offer, you've got to stay around for an hour and nine minutes. So if somebody's dropping off in an hour, they're never going to see it. 